Well, it's out. The Farmer's Almanac is saying cold and wet for Northern California. But we look at a few more things than just the Farmer's Almanac. This was up on my Facebook page. Fun discussion going on. All sorts of different things from persimmon seeds to if the corn, you can hear it, what the weather is going to be like. Let's get back to El Nino, though. And this is what we're talking about for today. Weak El Nino developing in the equatorial Pacific. So where is that? Well, here's the equator right here. And this is the area that we're looking at right now. It's warmer than average. So those sea surface temperatures are a bit warmer than where we should be this time of year, indicating a weak El Nino because we kind of look at how much warmer is it? Well, in the valley, last time we had a weak El Nino, we were seven to eight inches below normal for our precipitation for the season. And then for the northwest coast, even more than that, 10 inches below. But it's not exactly statistically, oh, we get a weak El Nino and then it's going to be drier than normal. In fact, when we take a look at a couple of the recent ones, 2014, 2015, below normal, to 2006, 2007 below normal, but then we get to 2004, 2005, and it actually was well above normal, and that plays itself out pretty much with each one that we looked at deeper behind that, that uh, pretty much were 50-50. Could be wetter, could be average, could be drier, so we'll have to wait and watch this one develop. Thanks for watching the Geek Lab. Be sure to subscribe to watch more. And let me know in the comments below what you'd like explained in the Geek Lab.